The Yankees and Indians with a rubber match on Sunday and before game time, former astronaut and former Ohio Senator, 91-year-old John Glenn being honored at Progressive Field. He throws out the first pitch and then asks the crowd to honor his friend Neil Armstrong with a moment of silence. Armstrong passed away on Saturday at the age of 82. Let's pick this one up in the top of the second inning. Two men on for Ichiro Suzuki. Suzuki lines one right back towards the mound. It's off the glove of Indian starter Ubaldo Jimenez. In to score is Eric Chavez, and the Yankees jump on top 1-0. Later in the frame, it's 2-0 New York. Man on third with two outs for Nick Swisher, and Swisher continues his hot hitting. He singles to left center. In to score is Ichiro. It's 3-0 New York, and Swisher has 31 RBIs in 31 games, batting second in the Yankees' order this season. Freddie Garcia getting the start for New York on Sunday. Bottom three, he's in a jam. Base is loaded in two outs, facing Carlos Santana, but Santana will fly out to shallow right field, and the Indians leave him loaded. However, in the fifth inning, the Indians have him loaded again. Two outs once more, and again it's Santana in the box, and this time the Indians' backstop will win the battle. He'll chop one up the middle, and it sneaks into center field. A two-run single cuts the Yankees' lead to 3-2, and it knocks Garcia out of the game after four and two-thirds innings of work. So the Yankees turn things over to the bullpen. It's reliever Boone Logan taking over with two on and two out, and he'll get Michael Brantley to ground out to the right side. Mark Deshera makes the play by himself, and the Yankees hang on to that one-run lead. Top six, Curtis Granderson leading off the frame, sitting on a milestone as he faces Indians reliever Tony Sipp. High fly ball, deep right, chew back, on the track, looking up, see ya! A home run for Granderson, and the Yankees now lead 4-2. The 200th career home run for Curtis Granderson, and he didn't even think he got all of it as he tosses the bat away in disgust. Still, it extends the Yankees' lead to two runs. Bottom nine, Rafael Soriano on for the save. One on, one out for Jason Kipnis, and Kipnis rockets one back towards the mound, and Soriano somehow gets the glove up and knocks it down and then recovers to make the out. Talk about a close shave for Soriano, the Yankees closer with the great reflexes, and he's able to get out number two. So that leaves things up to Osdrubal Cabrera, who represents the tying run for Cleveland. Line drive, run it to Sarah, and the Yankees win this one 4-2. Soriano records save number 33 on the season. Boone Logan picks up his fifth win of the year in relief, and the Yankees hold a four-game lead over the Tampa Bay Rays in the AL East.